If I think there's a way for you to get happier, I can get pretty insistent. Yes. So Alyssa has her top three examples of me being her happiness bully. Yeah, so number one, the time you very nicely flew to California to help me move apartments. Yes. And you had me working, getting rid of stuff and packing Hours. dawn till dusk. <laughs> yes multiple trips to we my boxes. We filled up the apartment yeah. trash chute. All know? the way, all the so way. So could, we could <laughs> not throw out one more item. It was lucky she was moving out. Number two is when you called and asked if you could get me a treadmill desk for my office because you thought I should be walking during the day. And I said yes. And as soon as I told my writing partner, Sarah, she said, oh, great. Now I have to get one because I can't sit there like a slug while you're walking uh, five miles a day. So then we both had uh, okay. a treadmill down. Okay, and then number three. Well, number three is a current happiness uh, bullying. Still doing it. Um, which is you're helping me uh, <laughs> get work done on the novel I'm writing with my writing partner. Yeah. You have lots of ideas that you like to text about how we can accomplish more Yes. more quickly mm, maybe but, i need to dial it back a little bit but it's helpful because i want to get things done i want to do these things in my life and sometimes you need a happiness bully it comes from a place of love <laughs>